of the locks is to be a boat elevator, allowing boats to move from one water level to a different water level. In this particular case, the freshwater lakes are the constant variable. The lake level fluctuates only about 18 to 24 inches annually throughout the entire year. Lake Union and Lake Washington are fed by major rivers and streams which come down from the Cascade Mountains. And based on rainfall and snow melt throughout the year, we do see that lake level fluctuate somewhere around two feet per year. However, the saltwater Puget Sound is affected by the gravitational pull of the moon and its effects on the Pacific Ocean's tides, and therefore experiences four tidal variances every day, which range from and include a high high tide, a high low, a low high, and a low low tide. And at any given point throughout the day, based on the gravitational pull of the moon and its effects on the Pacific Ocean's tides, we can see a difference between the fresh and salt water at an extremely high tide, maybe be as little as 5 feet, and at extremely low tides it can be nearly 30 feet. It's all based on the tide of the day. And the third function of the locks is actually to regulate the lake level and prevent flooding from occurring. If ever we were at risk of a flood on Lake Union or Lake Washington, we could prevent that from occurring by utilizing the spillway gates and spillway dam system, which is off to your left or port side of the boat. You'll see those six concrete arches, and some of them are partially open today, so we drain water out of the lakes and prevent floods from occurring. The locks are free to navigate through any vessel can navigate through the locks any time of day, any day of the year at no cost as they are funded by the Department of Defense and operated by the United States Army Corps of Engineers and have been so since construction began in 1911. Now we've just about dropped down to the saltwater level and in a few moments the doors off our bow will swing open and we'll be able to continue on our cruise today bound for Seattle's historic waterfront. We are scheduled for an on-time docking this afternoon down at Pier 55 as we make our way back into the shipping channel and out of the lock system. Samantha, your tour guide, will be back on the microphone to continue with her narrative today. So please enjoy the second half of today's trip. Thank you.